Hello and good morning, y'all, and welcome to Paul's Lost Remains. Not fully sure what we're getting into with this one. All I've really gathered is that we're camping, uh, we hear screaming in the middle of the night, and our buddy Paul is missing. Uh, so I'm just going to head right on into it. I'll have the game linked in the description if you want to play it yourself. Without further ado, Paul's Lost Remains. That was a majestic scream. Uh, what did I just hear? Was that Paul screaming? I have to check up on him. Okay, that's our little tent. Oh, hello. Did you spill ketchup, young man? Where is Paul gone? And what is all this blood? It's blood. It's not, it's not ketchup. It's, okay. I have to find him. Okay. He lost his, like, size 3 shoes. And his little tiny flashlight for ants. I'm assuming we're just going to follow the, the lip path here. Sounds like a typical game design. Hello. You picked up Paul's right arm. Uh, what? Pourquoi? Alright. That looks like a torso, maybe? I like how the clothes are fully intact, at least. What's this lit up down here, by the way? What we got? We got, like, more lights down there. Okie dokie. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? Cross. You placed Paul's right arm on the cross. Why? Why do we place Paul's right arm on the cross? There are many things we should be doing. Like, running away, calling the police, screaming, peeing our pants... Uh, there's a lot of things we could be doing right now. I'm not sure if, like, putting them on the cross is a good idea. But, uh, I guess we're gonna go ahead and grab another piece of them, maybe? Wreck of the start. I guess, uh, we're gonna be rebuilding Paul here. Is the general gist of this game. I can rebuild him. I can fix him. I've always spent long nights dreaming of Paul's chest. And now it's reality. I never dreamt I'd spend it like this. I don't even know what I'm talking about. You placed Paul's chest, goddamn right. I don't know if I can, like, pick up multiple parts of him. I'm gonna do one by one, I suppose. Face Paul's left arm on the cross. I mean, this is beautiful, isn't it? I love it. I'd not just subtly stand still there for a good thumbnail shot. Not me, no siree! But never do that. Okay. Let's go ahead and pick up... Ooh, what's his head? Hi, Paul. Paul, now that I'm carrying your head and you can hear me, because you got ears, I presume, uh, did you know that I upload to this YouTube channel seven days a week? I do a lot of itch horror, Tower Unite, occasional retro stuff, and co-op games? What? You're gonna subscribe today? Yowie wowie! Thank you so much, Paul! Here you go, here's your body again. Thank you for letting me plug myself, I never have the opportunity. Now we need his whittle little legs. Alright, so I'm assuming they're gonna be down this over, uh, down over here, because I think we got the head there. So we're probably gonna have to come down this way. We got, like, one leg there. Do we have the other leg over here, maybe? I just want to go the furthest distance for right now. Let's grab this leg first. Got his leg beautiful. We're going to also find out if I can carry multiple body parts. I somehow doubt it. Oh, we can carry multiple body parts. I haven't had to go back and forth like this. Oh, I've just been doing it for dramatic effect to uh, lengthen the video, of course. Improve that watch time. Hail YouTube. Uh, let's go. Build him up.
Well, for building a person, at least I uh, know I can cross that one off the old bucket list. Eh? You place Paul's left leg on the cross. Okay, he's fully rebuilt. Paul? Paul, you are complete now. Paul? He looks good as new. Ah! That is the sound I make some days when I wake up and like I'm having like those lower back spasms. Paul, what the hell happened to you? I have to run. Maybe I can reach my car. Hi, Paul. Paul. Come here. Do you want to talk about classic video series like llamas with hats? No? Where is my car? I know I know the camp's down here. Paul, I know you lost your limbs recently. The tendons aren't really working, but you are very slow. Excruciatingly slow. Oh, I'm going to take a sip of water really quick. Okay, we're good. I give you water, but you're a little bit too close. Uh, where am I, actually? Did I go the wrong way, Paul? Do you remember where we parked? Because I really don't remember where we parked. This looks like an, yeah, it's an invisible wall. Alright, Paul, I'm just going to the, the, give this the old scoochadoochah. Go right on by you. I took a wrong turn. I wanted to go back towards the camp, like where we have our tents. Uh, just so you know, you spilled a lot of ketchup in your tent. And it made quite a mess, and I'm not going to clean it. Because you are a 37-year-old man who should know better. When you got the fries at McDonald's, I told you you were going to make a mess. I told you you weren't going to like them. They are going to get cold. Just weren't going to hold up. Oh, you're breathing really heavy. I can hear you. All the way over here. This is not where the campsite is. Wait, were we like in a different part of the woods? Alright, Paul, I'm going back. I'm going to follow these lights again. Uh, just because this cross is in a different location than I remember. Huh. So maybe I was going the right way. Maybe we cut across down here? Paul, did you lose me? Oh, no, you didn't. Maybe we, like, walk down this way? Paul, I know that you died, but it does not give you an excuse to be such a little bitch. That looks like a car. I'm gonna leave you. You can have the woods to yourself. Ooh, you even got candlelight parking? Lovely. Later, Paul. I made it. The end. Thanks for playing. Nanny's games. I press start again by no, we're not rebuilding Paul. We're not rebuilding it, but I loved the I loved the scream. Alright, but that was Paul's Lost Remains. Um, not much to that. I found it highly amusing. I like the fact that I just woke up in the middle of the night with my friend being dead and dismembered, and I'm like, I'm gonna take his body parts that are conveniently scattered by these candles and rebuild them on a cross, and now he's a zombie. I, I love how ridiculously stupid this was, and uh, it killed eight minutes. So I'm grateful for that. That was fun. Uh, so, as always, again, I have this game linked in the description if you want to play it yourself. But, uh, y'all have a lovely day, take care, and as always, toodles, y'all!